Okay, so I'm out at my sister's place. She's moved into a new home and it's very dry and hot here. And it's also the summer. <laughs> and she told me that she wants to put together a little garden in the backyard. Um, but she hasn't really done much before. So I'm trying to get her started with a few things. After checking out the place, I, and uh, her experience level, taking that in mind, um, I'm recommending her start with just a few small things and not going full bore into like raised beds and stuff. And we're gonna do a few herbs and a couple tomatoes and some strawberries just for fun. And the trick, if you're just starting out from nothing, is to start small and try and get some early wins, um, get some yields so you kind of know what it's like to garden and get something back from it. And try not to invest too much money right out the gate, like be a little scrappy about it so that you don't feel like you're spending all this money and getting nothing back. Um, so that's what I'm trying to do with her. I've got her a few plant starts here that I'll show you. And I'm bringing her some of my um, old soil that we're gonna mix in and establish a few uh, pots just to get started. So here's the strawberries we're gonna do. I'm probably gonna leave this in this pot and just give this to her as is for now. Um, I'm gonna tell her don't expect to get a whole lot from this, but you'll get some enjoyment out of it. Maybe get a little bit of strawberries. We're doing some rosemary, some thyme and some oregano here. And we got some Roma tomatoes and some cherry tomatoes. And this should be a little Nice little combo to get started with. Um, initially, I was gonna set her up in a grow bag like this, but since her area is so dry, like look at this ground. This is this is desert, basically. <laughs> I'll show you the backyard in a second. Um, this is not gonna be, I don't want her to start with the grow bag. I want her to have plastic pot that's going to retain a little bit more moisture and then as she grows, pun intended I guess, um, with this stuff and her experience level then we'll talk about doing some raised beds but I think we're just going to do a couple uh, pots and see how things go. We're not going to spend a ton of money right out the gate. All right, so what we've done here is mixed in um, some of the soil that I had just sitting around with some empty pots and a bucket I drilled some holes in and I got one extra bag of soil just to kind of supplement and we'll pot these up and this will be our starter garden. All right, we got them potted up and I covered the soil with some mulch that I got free from my city. So our starter cost here has been very low because I really just had to pick up the plants and a little bit of extra soil. And then as a safety precaution, we put them on top of these chairs. There's rabbits in the area, so we weren't sure if they were gonna pick at them uh, just because it's something new. Uh, they probably won't even like them, but they might be curious enough to take a bite. I'm going to bring some chicken wire around next time I come over. But this is our starter garden, and hopefully um, she'll get some decent yields out of it, and we can she can grow from there. Pun intended.